lunch. Uh, I skipped breakfast this morning. Usually I have um, a green smoothie with uh, almond milk, uh, green spinach. Uh, what else did I put in that? Spinach, almond Oh, a banana. I always use a, a either a half or a whole banana. That makes it sweet. And some Splenda if you need it sweeter. I use cocoa sometimes and that's about 260 calories right around there. And it pretty much fills me up till about 11 o'clock. And then uh, I have lunch usually around 1230. Uh, sometimes I have snacks like um, like yogurt. Uh, I'm gonna, sorry. Like I'll have this Greek light fit yogurt that is um, 80 calories. That's what I'll have for a snack. Or sometimes I'll have uh, baby organic carrots for a snack. Doesn't sound too great, does it? But today I'm gonna make my lunch. And my lunch is gonna include the other half of the can of tuna fish. God, my boobs look huge in this. My boobs are huge. Okay. Um, <laughs> tuna fish, I'm gonna have a hard boiled egg. I'm gonna have some spring mix and some baby carrots on top of that. And I think that'll do it, except for my bit. Oh, I, I might have some hummus too, and some hummus. So I'm like, all right, my hands are clean. I have no virus on them. And uh, like I said, I'm gonna have a spring mix. I put about, I don't know, I'm starving. So I'm gonna put about, probably that's probably two cups. I don't know, two cups of the spring mix. And then I do baby carrots and the, oh, you gotta look at the serving size. That's something I've never really paid attention to. Um, I'm gonna have hard-boiled egg is a very good, uh, I cook a bunch of them at once and it's a very good pro protein source. My outshine bars, oh my gosh, if you need a snack, these guys, well I don't have them in a box right now, but outshine bars, tangerine. I don't know how I'm gonna talk people into eating this. Good thing for my Montreal steak seasoning. Garlic, pepper, stuff goes on my salad. I don't use a dressing, but I love this. Here it is, my food, my plate, nice big meal. It's gonna fill me up and can't wait to eat it. Do my Paula B Fitness. I'm just gonna go ahead and hit play, and you're
We are finished, but we're not done. And you kind of warm up. Just kind of keep moving. So we're working out our arm. We're stretching, stretching out our arms, what we just did. And our legs are moving. So I'd love some comments. I'd love for y'all to follow me. I'd love for you to make fun of me, <laughs> laugh with me, do whatever it takes to get through this very trying time of ours here. I'm going to uh, not just exercise and, and do good uh, do good things. I'm gonna, I mean, not just exercise and show you what I'm eating. I figured if I had anything to say, like they've canceled Wimbledon. They've delayed the Olympics and the, a year, and they've canceled Wimbledon for the first time since World War II. This is really an unprecedented thing. We've never had anything like it before, so tired of hearing about it and just want something normal every day funny and probably sick and crazy tune in to us we're gonna have some fun i hope so and i'm finished for now i'm gonna turn off my watch we'll be back for my walk and then i'm gonna edit all these things put them together and stick them on Facebook. You know, I'm not going to use that YouTube anymore, I don't think. I think I'm going to see how Facebook treats me. Hey, hey, guys. I've gone for my walk. So what I do is I walk at a very uh, good pace, not slow, as fast as, you know, I can do it. Just trying to keep it moderate again. Um, it's a beautiful day in Florida today. It's where I am. It's about 80 at the most. But it's been like 100 degrees almost already. Okay, so <clears throat> I walk at a nice pace, which we all can do. No excuses. I do add some arm exercises. I also add inspirational book on tape. And then I get busy with it. I'll check back in in a little while. Okay, two miles done, 14 minute miles. See, oh sorry, see I'm not really pushing myself to. It's hard enough for me though. Now we're going up a hill. Okay, two miles down and I'll be back. Okay, Whew. I'm sitting out on my front porch. <clears throat> I finished my track that I usually do. It was, uh, it's 4.87 miles. Uh, it was nice. It's really a nice day. So it was much easier. I feel the weight of the world lifted off my shoulders today because of uh, uh, not having to go back to retail until, you know, it's over. So I really felt good today. Um, the dogs know I'm here, but I haven't come back in yet. So uh, I wanted to tell you a couple things that I do also besides these two things that I have. And I don't do them every day, though. And I should. I love, I, I enjoy meditating. I enjoy Deepak Chopra and Oprah. Uh, they are very good beginners guided meditation. It helps a lot with um, just getting in the... Uh, in the moment, getting in the zone, getting in the now, it helps. And what was the other thing? I had a couple other things that I was going to tell you about. Oh well, yeah, we'll probably finish that out. But oh, my um, my books. I uh, listened to uh, I'm a Badass. I'm going to give you the description and everything, and the author and all that. Um, and uh, the power of now. Oh my goodness gracious. You know, if I would have known these things when I was 20 or 18, 
right out of high school. Boy, what a difference they were made. So if you're that age and watching this, I don't know why you would be, but if you are, I'm telling you, it is a game changer to live in the now and just trust the universe. Lag yeah, yeah. Your daily dose. Yeah, yeah. Left to milk comes out your nose. Lag, 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 yeah. Oh, yeah. Get your daily dose. Lag, yeah. Left to milk comes out your nose. Lag, lag.